Huh, I wonder what happened here. Yeah, well, I guess there's no Oreos left in the house. Although, I think I have one more pack in the kitchen. Where's my box? Uh-huh. Oh no! I guess Sam got to my stash too. Guys, I'm so fed up with this slime. I need to think of how to punish him. Uh-oh. I'll make a huge Oreo cake. And I won't share it with Sam. That'll teach him. So, um, I'll need this too. Mm-hmm. Well now, I believe I've got everything I need here. <laughs> Guys, I think she's gonna make a cake without me! I have to do something about it, like, now! Well, guys, today we're going to make a huge Oreo cake. I'll mix the ingredients with this bowl. For starters, we'll need roughly 530 grams of flour. If you're going to try this recipe, though, the amount of flour you'll take depends on the size of your cake. The guys and I are making an Oreo cake. Now we need to add baking powder, 16 grams. There we go. Oh, and why didn't you invite me to bake with you? It's time for some dark cocoa powder. Let's add it to the flour. I see now. You aren't talking to me. Don't you have any idea why I'm bearing a grudge against you? Well, I haven't learned to read your mind yet. What do you say about this evidence? Huh? Hey, it wasn't me who ate it all. It's all Fluffy. He did it with his own teeth. Yeah, right. Only Fluffy doesn't eat cookies. Hmm. We only need to mix all the ingredients now. There. See? Now we need to beat 14 chicken eggs. So I suggest you take a big and deep bowl. It's easier and faster to beat eggs with a mixer. But if you don't have one, you could do it with a whisk. Vroom, vroom. Candy delivery! Good that it's not Oreo cookies. Guys, Sue doesn't want to forgive me. Please comment under this video and say that I'm a good slime. To make the cookies sweet, I'll add a lot of powdered sugar. 350 grams. There, all done. Be careful with the mixer at this step to make sure the powdered sugar doesn't fly all over the place. What about adding some salt, too? Yeah, sure. Let's add some salt. Oh, I almost forgot. We should add 210 grams of vegetable oil. Now we need to mix everything carefully. Right, Sammy. Guys, let's have a poll. Do you like cakes? Then write in the comments, what's your favorite kind? Chocolate, berry, or maybe ice cream cake? Personally, I love cake with fruit and whipped cream. Mmm, yummy. Okay, it's time to mix the ingredients for the Oreo cake. Maybe it will be my favorite kind of cake from now on. Sue, so, there's something I need to tell you. If it's something urgent, I'm listening. Uh, I want to make a confession. It was me. I ate all the cookies. But I'm ready to make it right, so I bought you a whole new pack of Oreos. Here you go. All these cookies are yours. Oh, it's so nice of you. Besides, we can use these cookies for our cake filling. Also, I'm very glad that you didn't try to be sly about it and came clean. I forgive you. By the way, our dough is almost ready. We only need to add a little bit of milk. That's the chocolate and milk kind of dough we made. Now let's pour it into our baking molds. No need to hurry. It's important to have enough dough for both molds. Yeah, it looks like our cookie is going to be truly gigantic. Time to place our dough into the oven. While our dough is in the oven, Sue and I are gonna make the filling. We'll need 400 milliliters of heavy whipping cream and then Oreo cookies. Mmm, yum, yum. And... 15 grams of powdered sugar, Sammy. Right. First, we'll mix cream. 
and sugar powder. You should whip it to get a thick mixture that looks like a cloud. Sam, does our filling look like a cloud? Let me see. Huh, it's quite a fluffy cloud, just like the real thing. Now we're going to break the cookies that Sam gave me. <laughs> oh, come on. I already said I'm sorry. Silly Sammy. <laughs> we need it for our filling. Yeah? Well, okay then. You know what? Let's add all our cookies at once. Here we go! Now let's mix our whipped cream and broken cookies. Carefully, though. I want to make sure our cloud stays fluffy. A cloud with cookies? It's a miracle! Oh! It's time to get our dough out of the oven! Oh, hurry up and save the dough! Wow! Our cake cracked a little, so now it looks like an exploded volcano. <laughs> Don't you think it's a little too high for a cookie? Yeah, so we'll carefully cut the top layer off. Nice. Be careful. <laughs> Better ask an adult to help you. Mm, may I take the cookie cap and try it? Sure, if you can carry it. Yes, I'm ready to do anything to try it. <laughs> While Sam is trying the cake, we'll put the filling onto our base here. The more filling there is, the better the taste. You've got to be careful with the edges, though. That's right. I think that's enough. Now we only need to smooth it all out. And the final touch. Beautiful! Wow! It's a gigantic cookie! Yes, we've made an Oreo that will be big enough for everyone. Right. I definitely won't be able to eat this cookie without you. Hey, Sam! Oh, I'm kidding. Let's hurry up and have some tea. I've got it all ready here. Guys, if you like this cake, give this video a thumbs up. And write in the comments whether you like Oreo as much as we do. Listen, Shu, if I eat all the M&Ms, will you make a cake out of them too? <laughs> Bye, guys. Sam, we need to have a serious talk. Bye, guys. Sue, come on. I'm kidding. Gingerbread house, it was so delicious! <gasps> of course, I need a recipe right now! Uh, do you happen to know how to make a gingerbread house? No, huh? Uh, maybe you know the recipe? No? Uh, ooh, hey me, Mona me! Uh, well, you should know, come on, tell me! Uh, uh, well, for starters, uh, uh, I need some flour! Yep! <laughs> Second ingredient is butter. <laughs> Ginger, cinnamon, and lemon juice. I guess we'll also need some eggs. <laughs> Sam, what's going on here? In a gingerbread house, will you help me? No, because you spoiled all the product. Oh, what should I do then? I need a sign. Huh? What? what? Ouch! Ah, what is it? <laughs> Here's your sign. Uh, Sammy. Huh, interesting. <gasps> now this might just work. Uh, what are you up to, Susie? Oh, I'm home again. It's Timmy Dabba. Sammy, I've been waiting for you. Come closer, I'll tell you a secret. Huh? Secrets? I love secrets. Huh? Oh, let me go. Sammy, stop messing around. We've already started shooting. Huh? Oh, I'm sorry, I get carried away, Sue. Hello, dear viewers. Hello, 
everyone! Today we'll make a cute house using these stencils. And Sam the Builder's team is here! What should we do first? Change! <laughs> and cut it out! <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. So first, we need to get rid of all the wrappers. Hmm, these won't be enough. Does anyone else have candies? We have nothing! Mm -hmm. Um, uh -huh. gotcha, sweet tooth. Why so many to marinate? No, to fry them. <laughs> wait, 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 what? To fry them? Susie, no! This thing is hot! Everything will melt! Help! Sue, this is crazy! Stop panicking, Sammy. Just watch. Holy cannoli! I, I mean, holy titties! It was so mesmerizing! Uh, oh, no! I'm At least the caramel has already cooled down. Uh, uh, thank you. Guys, just check out this beauty. I'm sorry, but what is that? You said we were making a house? And this'll be its foundation. Or the floor. <laughs> now let's take care of the walls. Just don't get burned while placing candy. Never made cheddar, so it's gonna be a caramel house. Give a thumbs up to it! Yay! Come on, you stand properly. Now we're talking. <laughs> while the caramel is still soft, we'll take our stencils and carefully put them here. Outlining the contours of the house. This'll be a wall with a window. The main thing here is not to leave the stencils for too long. Caramel solidifies quickly. Great! It remains only to get rid of the extra caramel <gasps> and... Shut it, Sue! Think what you're saying! There's no <clears throat> such thing as extra caramel! Am I right, Uni? Uh, Uni, where are you? Oh, my. Oh! Hey, Sammy, get the beast under control before it eats everything! Uh, hey, hey, Uni! Uh, come here! Oh, uh, 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 here's an idea! Ah, uh, this is just what I need! Uh, uh, hey, buddy! Uh, that's it! Well done! Uh, Ew, give me a couple of seconds to catch my breath and we'll continue. Down, Uni! Press it down! Uh, Every house had at least four walls and a reliable roof. In our case, all the pieces are made more or less the same way. This is the wall with the front door. And where did Sammy go? Let's see. Um, who wants to melt candy? I, I want. Can I, can I please? Hush, hush! Don't push. There's enough for everyone. Yes. Red goes here, uh, and yellow to the right. right. It doesn't, doesn't look, look bad. bad. Wow, it's so, so beautiful. beautiful. Oh, well, I tried. It's Sammy's fault for missing the last step here. Sammy doesn't miss anything. Sammy found this. <gasps> Did that stem so fall? Yep, right on the caramel pancake. Looks good, though. Thumbs up if you agree. <gasps> this is awesome. Ugh, thanks, Stevie Dabba. Uh, I mean, that's exactly what I wanted. <laughs> so, all the pieces are ready. It means we can put up our house. Sammy, can you bring me some water? Sure, uh, sparkling still? <laughs> no, I won't drink it. The water will stick the caramel together. So this won't be enough. Hmm. Couldn't you have said it right away? Um, and gorgeous! Now well, that's better. <laughs> now let's take a brush, dip it in the water, and start attaching the pieces. Stuck together it looks kind of mm, unreal. Think for yourself. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you? I'll complain to the Slime Protection Society. <laughs> oh, come on, Sammy. I was just kidding. And there's no such society. Don't invent stuff. Um, uh, hello, we're from the Slime Protection Society and we're here with an inspection. Uh, slime Sam was treated disrespectfully. The fine is that caramel house. Okay, all right. Just let me finish and decorate it. Wait, what? Susie, are you serious? We'll decorate it? Yep. I saved a lot of goodies for this. So stay tuned, fellas. Is everyone ready? I'm ready. One, two, three. <laughs> I'm flying. <laughs> It's more like candy roof tiles. We'll attach them with a drop of water. Yeah, it's all wet here from your water. What am I, Cinderella? Wait a minute, shiver me, shiver me, come back, you! I said come back and clean it up! Oh, that mischievous unicorn. And we're done with the half of the roof. Another half is waiting. 
Oh, wow, this is so beautiful! And of course, you can decorate your houses just like you want. Yeah, yeah, only first you need to get the sweet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> la la la, I'm gonna have a cup of tea. <laughs> la la la, what? Where did my marshmallows go? How do you like this decor, Susie? Oh, well done. <laughs> we'll decorate windows and the doorway with this. Just a little sizing required. Hmm. Huh? <laughs> yeah, this will be what good. What about this, Sue? Uh, like this? <laughs> oh, come on, you, a touch. <laughs> You'd better be careful or those slime defenders will come again. <laughs> Let me finish this myself. And the last marshmallow thingy? Now this is a completely different look. Make way, Susie! We need to install something! <laughs> Wait, what's all this? I'll put the best fans! But why don't we make it out of sweets, too? Uh, uh, don't you think that we already have nothing sweet at home? Okay, I'm gonna have to use my secret stash for this. Here we go! These red and white candies will work just fine. Cheddar me cheddar, Susie! It's just wonderful! Mm, I simply have to try you my sweet. No, oh, wait, <laughs> mister. Don't drool over here. Um, uh, how was that? Bibbity, bobbity, subscribity? No? Ah, uh, I like that. Oh, great! And the final touch for today. Oh, yes! Are you sure? I said yes! <laughs> Friends, let's take a good look at our house until we eat it all! <laughs> Happy every day, I want a chocolate! Choo choo choo! Choo choo choo! No, no, no! Uh oh! <laughs> Nom 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 Forget. Oh, I'll burst if I eat more. <laughs> it's great that we can feed all our friends with our caramel house. Hi, all. What are you feeding your friends here? Why didn't you call me? Oh? <gasps> I knew we forgot something. I'm off. <laughs> see you around, people. We'll see you in our next video, friends. Oh, Roger, mm. what's up? Uh, here's the thing. Oh, I know. Here. This is for you. We'll Aww. feed you something tasty in the next episode. Okay, bye bye. In the office of the dentist. Oh, Sammy. Hey, what's wrong? You've already listed each medical specialist separately. But okay, then it will be 48. And here's another one for a cute dress up. <laughs> <laughs> Agreed. 49. Let's put down a cute old man. What else? What else? Just one more way. Just one more way to use cotton and I'll have nailed it. All right, Sammy. Let's just say you did it. No, Sue. I can't title my book 50 Ways to Use Miraculous Cotton and list only 49 of them. Huh. I think I know one way to use miraculous cotton. In cooking. Are you serious? Oh, I can't wait to see that. Then what are you waiting for? Come on. Hi, guys. As you might have already guessed, today we are going to make cotton candy. How come I didn't think of that type of cotton in the first place? We 
we should have used that cotton candy maker a long time ago, Sue. Well, it's not me who always eats up all the sugar in our house. True. I like my five o'clock tea with eight spoonfuls at least. <laughs> so, am I getting eight portions of cotton candy? Better. You're gonna get a multi-layered cotton candy cake. Good macaroons! Sounds like a dream come true. Uh, Sue, uh, what are you doing? Well, do you want your cake to be colorful? Sure! And one way to do that is to color the sugar. Oops. Ooh, sounds tasty. I'm ready, Sue. <laughs> Sammy, you're too ready. Don't add too much of the food coloring right away, guys. Are you sure that just a few drops are enough, Sue? Don't worry, Sammy. We can make it brighter later if needed. And now comes our really fun part. We're gonna just rub the plastic bag against the table. Or you can just rub it between your hands, this way, very thoroughly. Shiver me shutters! It really is green now, people! Now that we're done with the first color, let's make some more. I'm on it, Susie! Hey, where are the plastic bags? Found one! Uh, I must spill nothing. There we go. Do you want to try that coloring technique, Sammy? Are you kidding? Wait to do that! <laughs> All right, on your mark, get set, go! Guys, would you just look at this? The colors are amazing! My yellow sugar turned out better than your purple, though. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah? Then what would you say about these? because of that colorful sweetness. Guys, check this out. You can use your colored sugar in more than one way. <laughs> it can become a cool decorative element as well. But you remember why we needed it in the first place, right? So stay tuned, guys. Let's get to the cotton candy making. Woohoo! Easy, tiger. Huh? You have to be careful with an appliance like this. You see this funny thing in the middle? It's the heating element. Once we put sugar over here and turn it on... It's gonna start melting sugar at about 190 degrees Celsius! Woo, that's hot! That's right! So, you guys should be extremely careful or ask your parents to help. Here we go! Hey, it's coming up, Sue! Chill out, Sammy. I can see everything. This way. Just look at all those fluffy sugar threads. Stop getting distracted, Susan. Just roll it up. Ta-da! Well, Sammy, what do you say about our very first homemade cotton candy? It looks like a sweet and fluffy cloud. Oh, I have to taste it. Um, um. What's there to taste? <laughs> Sammy, stop that. You could give me some. Ouch! This is the best day of my life. So beautiful. Oh, a unicorn. Wait, unicorns eat cotton candy? No, 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 no. Tammy, are you okay? Uh, yeah, totally. But uh, don't tell Sue about that. Let's proceed with the next color. Here we go. And start. Huh, I haven't heard from Sammy for a while now. I wonder what he's doing. I'm here, Susie. Did you know that the very first cotton candy appeared back in the 15th century in Italia? The Venetians mastered that craftsmanship and made the 1,286 items from cotton candy for one fancy royal party. But sugar was too expensive back then, and cotton candy was available only to rich people. Susan, what's taking you so long with that yellow? Uh, nothing. Please, tell me more about cotton candy. Not until 1897 did a dentist and a confectioner create a miraculous cotton candy machine. Here is the yellow one. Susan, at this rate, we will never taste a cotton candy cake. Oh, maybe we will. 
Ah, you're right. Let me speed up with the rest of the colors then. Here we go. Check this out, guys. Now we have everything to shape our cake. Wait a second, Susie. We might need to make the green again. Uh, I couldn't resist. <laughs> oh, Sammy. <laughs> guys, we'll be right back. Oop, oop. Susie, I brought what you asked for. Thank you, Sammy. Guys, now we're gonna work quite fast, so watch closely. To make the first layer of our cake, we'll take the blue cotton candy and slide it right into this silicone mold, like this. Oh, it's like a piece of cloud on the plate. Wow. Next, we'll take another cotton candy and repeat the same procedure. Here we go. We need to do this with all the colors of cotton candy that we've made today. Work in gloves so that cotton candy doesn't melt from the heat of your hands. And remember that you can use as many cotton candy layers as you want. The more layers there are, the sweeter your cake will be. Isn't that what we're going for? <laughs> okay, we're almost done here. You're about to see some real confectionery magic, people. Are you ready? Let's do this. Cheddars. That was totally awesome, Susie! Ha. <laughs> Wait till you hear that there is more. Guys, try not to squeeze your cotton candy too tightly so that you can still take it out of the mold. Check out this rainbow beauty. Susie, it looks so delicious! When will I taste it? As soon as we decorate it. <gasps> Actually, I have an idea. We will decorate each piece of our cake individually. Guys, always be careful with a knife. Or, better yet, ask an adult to help you at this stage. Actually, you can ask your parents to join you for the decoration part as well. Check out what I've got here, Susie. Cool. But this is not enough. Sue, what did you do with my decor? Now that's more like it. Just look at all this beauty, Sammy. Awesome, right? Shiver me sprinkles, so many cool things. This piece we'll decorate with marshmallows. And let this one be chocolatey. Here we go. I want to make one look really magical. Now anyone who eats it can make a wish upon a star. <laughs> oh, this looks like a whole party on a single cake. <laughs> Willy Wonka style. Why are you chilling out here? Move! Yeah. And last but not least, funny bubbles. Boop, boop, boop. Well, Sammy, are you happy with your cake? Not quite yet. I think we can totally get wild. <laughs> Sammy, that's a perfect idea. But we had better do this really fast. Mmm, vanilla, my favorite. A glance at our cake before the ice cream melts. Or before I eat everything. All right, Sammy, we've got cake, we've got tea. Oh, plates. Holy, Susan, who needs them? Oh, my precious, come to papa. It was the best idea ever to make this cake, Susie. Guys, if you like cotton candy, you should definitely try to make this cake at home. You're gonna love it. Thanks for being with us today. Oh, wait a second. That's better.
better. Subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button. Bye-bye, everyone. Sammy, aren't you going to write that book of yours about cotton? Um, 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 um. Ah, forget it. I'm too full to work right now. Um, 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 um. Wait! There's some Nutella in the fridge. 